Hi folks and welcome to another episode of Tableau in 2 Minutes. Today we're going to be covering how to do a cross database join. What on earth is one of those and why would you want to do it? Well, let me show you. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm actually going to connect to a Microsoft Excel workbook. And full of stock market prices, not that that's particularly relevant. And what we're going to do is I'm going to drag this monthly table out. Now you can see that on this monthly table we have uh, the years and months over on this left-hand column and then all of the stock market data on the right-hand side. Well, what if we wanted to see how this correlated with uh, maybe another piece of high-level economic data? Well, it's not available in our workbook and it used to be prior to Tableau 10 that the only way to join these two up was to create two separate connections and then to blend the data on the surface. But we have this data at exactly the same level of aggregation that we have our stock market data. So we're going to create what's called a cross database join. That means we're joining between uh, essentially two separate or semi-separate uh, data connections. And the way to do it after you set up your first connection is to click on add right here. We're going to add a connection to a second Excel workbook. And you can see that our second workbook now shows up in orange right here. This is the first one. This is the stock market data with the blue tag, retail sales with the orange tag. And we use the monthly data from our stock market uh, workbook. So we're going to drag out our monthly data from the retail sales workbook. Now you can see this doesn't join properly and that's okay. We're going to go ahead and set the join criteria. It's actually on the field called F1, which doesn't have a doesn't have a header. But when we join on F1, which is this column right here, you can see that we've now connected together two data tables from two Excel workbooks. There you go. So the, the blue columns come from the stock market table, the orange columns from the retail sales table. Now, you don't have to limit yourself to doing this with Excel workbooks. You could do this with two different database connections. You could do it to uh, connections within the same database. Uh, you can do it with Excel connections and CSV connections. Really anything, any two different types of data connections, if you have them at the same level of aggregation and you want to do the join within Tableau, you can go ahead and do that using these uh, cross database joins. So that does it for this episode of Tableau in two minutes. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments. If you like what you hear, then hit subscribe for more Tableau tips and tricks, and we will see you next time.